Welcome to Algebra 2, Lesson 3-1, Graphing Polynomial Functions, Example 1, Classify Polynomials. Um, let's continue looking at Example 1. How can you write a polynomial in standard form and use it to identify the leading coefficient, the degree, and the number of terms? Negative 4x plus 9 plus 2x cubed. Um, we, you know that monomial is when you have any, um, any expression, right, without addition or subtraction. So negative 4x, if this was a function or an expression, this itself by itself would be a monomial. But altogether, this is a polynomial. So these monomials um, that are broken down, by the addition sign or subtraction sign, they're called terms. We have one, two, three terms in this polynomial. The degree of the term with one variable is the exponent of that variable. So what does that mean? Look at negative four x. The exponent of the variable is one. So the degree of the first term is one. Degree of nine, you do not have a variable. But if you were to have a variable, 9 would be equal to 9 times x to the 0th power, right? So the degree of the, of the variable here is 0. Degree of the third term would be the, the 3 over here, right? Because that's the power of the variable. So when we talk about the degree, we're talking about the power of the exponent of the variable in that term, okay? Uh, so the standard form of a polynomial um, looks like different terms combined, and it is ordered from descending um, numerical order from, uh, with the degree. Okay, so this, if you were to um, if you were to rearrange this, you would have to write the biggest degree first. So. The term with the biggest degree would be 2x cubed, right? And then the next biggest would be minus 4x. And then the last one is plus 9, right? So this is the standard form, OK? The leading coefficient is the first coefficient of the leading term, the first term in the standard form. So here we have a leading coefficient of 2. The degree of the polynomial, so degree of this term would be 1, like individual uh, terms would have the different degrees, right? The degree of a polynomial is talking about the whole degree. So the whole polynomial's degree would be the greatest degree. So you don't have to add the degrees, you just look at the greatest degree. So you look at the first term, and that is degree 3. So this polynomial has a degree of 3, okay? so. W there are different ways to talk about degree. You can talk about the degree of the term, or you can talk about the degree of the polynomial. Okay, so this is called a cubic polynomial. So let's look at try number one. What is each polynomial in standard form, and what are the leading coefficient, the degree, and the number of terms of each? Look at the polynomial, write them in standard form, um, and identify um, leading coefficient, the degree, and the number of the terms. Pause the video and come back when you're ready for answers. Okay, are you ready? All right, so try number one, A. If you write this in standard form, what would you get? Yeah, you need to write this from the greatest power with the greatest power, which would be your second term, right? So negative 3x to the fourth power, and then the next biggest degree with uh, the term with the biggest degree would be negative five x to the cube, and then plus two x, right? And then plus six. So you just figure out the degree of each term, and then you order them from the greatest to the least. That's the standard form. And now we can figure out the leading coefficient easily. So the leading coefficient would be the coefficient of the leading term here. So that would be negative 3. 
and then the degree of the polynomial would be the highest degree for and the number of terms would be one two three four right so that would be one a what about one b so the lead if you write this in standard form you would get you would get um, let's see the greatest power would be the sixth power so 2x to the sixth power would be your first term and then x to the fifth power minus 3x to the fourth power right we're just ordering from uh, the greatest to the least and then plus 4x cubed minus 8x, right? And so what would be the leading coefficient now? Now that we have the standard form, it's really easy to point out the leading coefficient, which is just 2, right? 2 is the coefficient of the leading term. And the degree of the polynomial would be the greatest degree of your term, which is 6. And then the number of terms is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 5. Okay. So that's it. All right, so please remember these important vocabulary words um, because we're going to be talking about this um, on and on throughout this lesson and also throughout this topic, okay? So this is the basic term you need to know before we learn anything else in this lesson. All right, so we'll continue with the next example in the next video.